Okay, hello and welcome to another watch review. Today we're doing something a little bit different. Uh, I'm going to step away from the, my usual Japanese uh, collection, uh, although I've done some Swiss watches in the past, and I focus on uh, Jean Richard's um, Terrascope. These were available um, recently on some online vendors for some pretty significant discounts. And, uh, you know, for the price and the history of the watch and the, the, the way it's made, I really couldn't help picking up actually a couple of them. Uh, I'm using the the box video here to do a little bit of an unboxing video because I think the, the, the presentation is, is kind of unique and, and fun. Um, it comes in kind of a, um, a camera case with, with a strap. Uh, and the actual watch itself is presented in the, in the kind of camera case style um, pouch. Let's take that out. Uh, pretty unique presentation for a unique watch. Um, a lot of fun, I think. You can see like the you know the heritage and the, the playfulness of the brand um, as it comes back again these days, uh, to, as um, you know, a, a, an, an, an affordable, uh, high quality Swiss watch uh, for people to be looking at. Um, this one is the um, the Glacier Patrol uh, Limited Edition. Um, I got this one because I thought the dial was uh, really unique. Uh, I don't know if you can see it in this video or not, but it's got kind of a, a, a patterned dark gray dial, um, kind of maybe like a, a snow crystal effect on, on the dial itself. Um, I thought that was just, you know, pretty cool. Um, the wash itself uh, is a very, very unique and very, very well-made case, and that's pretty much the reason I, I bought it was for the cases and the case work. Uh, it's got kind of like, you know, for me, maybe people will disagree with me, but it's got a mix of of Panerai, Hublot, and Armas Piguet happening in the case. Um, Hublot, I think, is probably um, most obvious, and that's no mistake. The designer of this watch, Mijat, was also the designer of, well, one of the designers of the Big Bang. So, you know, if you find similarities in the case and the way it's put together, uh, that's no mistake. The case itself is made out of many parts. You can see it online. Um, you know, the, these side parts are separate from the case itself. The bezel is separate. The inside uh, monoblock part in the center is also separate. Uh, you can't see any seams. Um, it's very, very well machined and very well put together. But those separate case parts really allow the... Uh, uh, the, the, diff the different um, finishing surfaces to, to be seen. I mean, you can just see, you know, the vertical brushing here is just, you know, it's, it's, it's fantastic. I mean, I, I would be probably, uh, you know, exaggerating only slightly to say that it's close to Audemars Piguet type quality. Uh, but just, you know, for me, uh, the, the, the finishing is, is, is really something that I enjoy on a, on, a, on a watch, particularly the Swiss watches do it very well. And for the price point that this was available at, uh, you really can't get close. Uh, this I actually purchased on sale for about $700. And the retail price I think is like three and a half thousand dollars. I mean, it, it's Jean Richard. So it is, um, uh, you know, close family relations under the same company, um, the Sowin Group as uh, Girard Perigo. So, I mean, the heritage is there, the history is there, the quality is there, um, you know, lovely rubber, rubber strap, you get a sealed case back that's a very deep, high quality engraving. Um, inside is, is an SW200 Salida movement, um, which helps keep the price down. I don't see anything wrong with that. I'm not like an in-house uh, movement snob. I mean, if, if I was, then... You know, I mean, my Seiko's and Orient's. I mean, they they fit that 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 requirement quite well. So uh, I don't see that that in itself is a, a particular uh, you know desirable factor. Only when you get up into really exotic watches does that become something truly special. I think. But for this watch, it, it was the style, the 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 quality of the case, um, a good movement in it, um, very nice bracelet with a you know high quality deployment on it. Um, very comfortable on the wrist and uh, you know quite, quite unique um, all those elements together combined with a, what you know admittedly a fantastic price uh, is what sold me on this watch I think um, you know if you can find them on sale they're well worth picking up out of the collection I actually um, added a, a white diver after this one the aquascope because I, I just you know I couldn't resist spending more money, which is probably not a good thing, but you know, for the price, I mean, they, they really can't be beat. Um, a lot of character, a lot of style for not a lot of money. Um, Jean Richard Terrascope, 
Uh, fantastic watch for the money. Highly recommend finding one, picking it up if you can. Uh, really enjoyable watch to add to anybody's collection. Thanks very much for watching. Cheers. Bye.